my channel and welcome to a brand new video i don't know why i just said good morning because it's morning now but when you guys watch it it's probably not going to be good morning <laughs> today's video this is probably apart from a vlog this is probably the earliest video i've ever filmed it's currently um 10 to 7 in the morning um i've been up since about six o'clock um so as you can tell by the title and obviously the um time of this video this is going to be my get ready with me for work. I know that I used to struggle with like being able to be motivated in the morning and getting up in the morning um, and having like kind of that motivation to get ready. So I thought I would share like my kind of tips and tricks and stuff to having like sort of a motivational morning, so to speak. I've got a bit of a sore throat, so excuse my voice because I sound really like... <sighs> If you do enjoy this video please as always give it a huge thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and yeah let's get into the video so first things first i always have to have a cup of tea even while i'm getting ready in the morning a cup of tea or a cup of coffee usually i have a cup of coffee um but i literally um lately i've just not really been feeling coffee um i've just been like waking up and really wanting a tea um so i've been having tea instead of coffee um usually sometimes if i do that if i have a tea when i get up i'll have a coffee when i get to work that's one thing obviously that helps my mornings my tea <laughs> um and then i don't know if you can see because there is more but i've lit candles this morning just found that candles usually i only light them in the morning on my day off um but i've just found that candles will just make me feel like in a way cozy which obviously like you think we well, don't want to be cozy shot because that'll make you want to go back to bed but not like that like cozy and then like happy um um then that kind of makes me like more motivated if that makes sense um yeah, so, I don't know why this, this is cutting off the top of my head, so I'm sorry. Candles always help me. I've literally probably struggled with getting up in the morning since I was like a child, like a fetus. I'm not even joking. Like, the amount of times my mum would have to come into my room and be like, Charlotte, it's time to get up. And I'd be like, mm, like proper whinging. Um, and then like, just go back to sleep. <laughs> And then end up being like late and rushing around and that's kind of just carried on throughout my like adult life and i hate it because there's nothing i hate more than rushing around so i just don't know like why i do it because i hate the rushing around and it would literally make me so annoyed and then it sets you up in such a bad mood for the rest of the day um so i kind of I have to put my foot down with myself and devise like a morning routine um that i needed to stick to it does help having a morning routine like a set out plan of what you do every morning it really does help um so definitely advise like creating your own morning routine because you create it to suit you as well so it's going to work for you because you're going to create it for yourself like don't get me wrong i'm not sat here like bolt awake ready to start the day i'm still like <laughs> tired and i'm still kind of sat here wishing like not wishing but like wouldn't say no to being able to get back into bed do you know what i mean but um it definitely is easier like i mean i went i used to like um snooze my alarm like until seven o'clock or whatever and then all half seven and then be like completely rushing around trying to get everything sorted already like trying to get ready and everything to be able to go to work and it's just not like it just puts you in such a bad mood and like just really doesn't set you up well for the day now um i don't actually put a lot of makeup on when it comes to work um sometimes i don't even put foundation on so this is um new for me um <laughs> but to be honest i haven't been that well um the last couple of days so i'm just kind of trying to make my um face look a bit more like lifelike i don't like go all out with my makeup um kind of like 
contouring and all that. I just put like probably a bit of bronzer on, a bit of mascara on. I don't go through all the trouble of like highlighting and stuff because I just prefer to keep that for like weekends because then I can really like do my makeup and like enjoy it kind of things. So another like thing, say another thing. So like it stops me seizing my alarm. Um, our cat Marvel, he has got to the habit of when he hears our alarm, he starts meowing. So if I've set my alarm for six o'clock, say, and it goes off and I go to like reset it for like half past six, quarter to seven, he'll already be meowing. So I'll have to get up, which is a really good thing. So get a cat. Do, I have been trying to like meditate in the morning as well. So never really been into like all of that, like meditating and stuff, but I tried it and I actually really liked it, it really relaxed me. Um, and it's like, it just sets you up for the day. Um, it's really good to do it at night time as well, because I find that you have a better night's sleep when you do it at night time. So um, that's another good um, tip. Um, with the meditating as well because I sometimes find that um, my anxiety can cause me to have like a really like it can make my mornings just shit sometimes in all honesty so um doing like the meditation stuff does really calm you down and I feel like it takes away some of the anxiety sometimes so you can actually get on with your morning rather than um worrying about that um so that's another thing why I do it my hair's just at that horrible stage where it needs like washing. Another good one as well, and um, is what I found doing helps me is literally like planning the night before, so planning like everything. So like my lunch, my breakfast, making sure I know what I'm going to have for breakfast because like I chop and change all the time um, and also um, get my outfit like out the night before, like planning my clothes. Oh, I knew there was something I was missing when I was in Primark. I was meant to get a new eyebrow pencil. These brows def desperately need doing. I'm not actually going to bother that much with them this morning because they need doing anyway so don't really want to draw more attention to them. Another thing as well that I've just recently started doing because I needed to, I try as well when I get up, like so when my alarm goes off, um, I'll obviously like take a couple of minutes to kind of, you know, wake up. But then I don't look at my phone. I haven't looked. At, I haven't got, like gone on Twitter or Instagram or anything um, this morning because I find that if I do that, I start to like. It, it makes you tired as well, and then you end up sitting there, like either sat in bed or sitting on the sofa, scrolling and scrolling and scrolling, and then it, like I don't feel motivated at all. So um, I've sort of started like waiting until i'm literally completely ready so like done everything i need to do like my makeup my hair um got everything so we got dressed um and done all of that stuff um i'll wait until i'm like there before i even let myself have a look on my phone so that's really really good especially for someone if you do like to go on your phone a lot like if you like to go on when you first wake up in the morning um and kind of like catch up on anything that's been going on overnight I can and then I end up being on there for absolutely ages um and it just doesn't it just makes me like late and stuff and demotivated and stuff and then I end up just sitting on there for ages and it don't help and obviously like one of my number one tips is make sure you're getting a good night's sleep because obviously that is going to help in the morning time. Um, I've started like trying to not be on my phone so much. Everyone does it like before bed, you kind of check social media and all that. 
we all do it we're all guilty of it it's just the day like it's just how it is like um like today um but i'm trying to um oh good i'm really not saying sorry i'm trying to like um not be on my phone so much um obviously so then like going to bed was when i would like kind of sit on my phone check social media and then go to sleep and i just don't feel like it gives you a good night's sleep or sets you up for a good night's sleep so i've now started like um reading again i used to read like all the time when i was little um so i've just started reading again so i'll read um like a couple of chapters before bed and i've just found that my sleep is so so much better um and also i have this app called um well i did have a rain sounds app but now i've actually been using an app called calm and um it's really really good because it's got all the meditation stuff on there as well um but it's got like sleep sounds so you can literally have anything but like, anything that makes you like sleepy or like send you off into a good sleep you can have on there there's all sorts of like sounds and things on there um but obviously i've been i love like listening the rain really calms me um so that sends me to sleep really well so um i've been having um one of the rain um settings on there so that sends me off into a really good sleep so that is what i've been doing and i've have found that like i'm waking up like like whereas before i'd probably wake up like a couple of times during the night and um, that's not happening i'm like literally waking up when my alarm goes off in the morning we're gonna end this video now just because i don't want it to be like long i kind of want it to be like a short snappy get ready with me here's my tips on how to have a good motivational morning want it i'll do an updated morning routine because I've, I've got a morning routine on there at the minute but that was when i um it was when i was off work so um it's my morning routine has changed drastically now because obviously i work every day um so if anyone wants an updated one i am thinking of doing an updated one um soon you enjoyed this video and if you have please give it a huge thumbs up got some really good videos coming um over the next couple of weeks just bear with me if they're not on time so obviously i've always said that my schedule uploads are wednesday and saturday i've recently added kind of like a bonus video on a monday um if i have like a video to upload that's my extra upload day is a monday but um sometimes i do kind of obviously because i work full time and at the moment i've been covering some saturdays so i'm actually doing three saturdays this month whereas i'd usually do like one and three um, so I'm obviously Saturdays then um, are usually my days for f like when I film stuff or I up, um, edit stuff so I've kind of like been having to juggle that because I'm working, um, I worked last Saturday, I'm working this Saturday and then next Saturday is my Saturday off um, so I'm kind of trying to get it all done in a week or on a Sunday and obviously on a Sunday me and Callum kind of like want to just chill out and not really do a lot um, so especially on a Sunday where I've been working on the Saturday. So if there is a video that's obviously, if I do miss a Wednesday upload or a Saturday upload, I do apologise, but just bear with me because it's literally so difficult um, trying to do it all. And and obviously I have to go running in the evening as well because I'm training for half marathon. So um, trying to run in the evening, edit a video if I've got it and get it uploaded is really hard sometimes. So if I do miss an upload day, um, I, feel, I feel like this, this was originally scheduled for Wednesday, but I feel like you're probably going to get it on Thursday, possibly. So, yeah, because I just don't think, by the time I've edited it um, and stuff, I don't think it's going to be up Wednesday night. So, um, probably, you're probably going to get this Thursday. But just know that if I miss a day, I will, will try my best to still upload it. Like, it won't... I'll, I don't ever ever want to miss a video like I might miss the day but it'll go up a day later um so just keep like the notification bell on so you know also follow me on my Instagram I'll put it here um because um I will update and post on there and um, if there's going to be any like late video uploads or anything like that um, me and Calum are actually filming a really exciting video in the weekend I'm so excited about it I can't wait so keep your eyes peeled for that I think that's going to be Monday's video um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you on my next one bye guys